welcome to advanced geography class so we are discussing the major natural regions of the world today we will discuss about another natural region of the world that is mediterranean region mediterranean region is located in the western margins of the continents as well as in the northern part of tropical desert region this natural region is characterized by hot and dry summer and cold and wet winter rainfall occurs in winter in this region the summer season is little longer than the winter season the average annual temperature is 8 degree celsius to 25 degree celsius average annual rainfall is 25 to 75 cm and the vegetation grown in this region are evergreen short trees and shrubs such type of natural condition generally prevails around the mediterranean sea and therefore it is known as mediterranean region mediterranean region include southern europe southwestern asia northern africa the coastal california of north america central chile of south america cape coast of south africa and southwest coast of australia so all these regions uh, are influenced by mediterranean type of climate and therefore these areas are known as mediterranean regions the main occupation of the pe uh, people is agriculture crops like wheat barley maize cotton tobacco etc are cultivated in the plains and on the hill slopes fruits like grapes apples etc are cultivated various food items and different types of wine are prepared from the fruits and are exported to different foreign countries thus the region has become world famous for its food based large scale industrial production the entire region is economically very advanced and density of population is also very high so students hope you have understood see one thing i want to tell you this uh, major natural regions of the world it is very very important because one question is sure to come in exam from this uh natural regions any any natural region you will ask that means uh about uh, climate and vegetation found in a particular natural region uh, say mediterranean region or monsoon region or equatorial region any region it may be asked and its vegetation or sometimes give a description of the lifestyle of the people living in um equatorial region then you have to write how the people live in that equatorial region what is their source of income okay so from each of the major natural regions of the world you have to make it clear about the characteristics then the lifestyle of the people type of vegetation available in that uh, region etc so you have to go very thoroughly through these natural regions Thank you.